when I started working with bacteria, I realized that the essence with which they carry out their life, such a you know small organism, some one micron by 0.8 micron in size, and the vigor with which they tackle each and every stressful condition. This is something which made me think that these bacteria are not only very vigorous in their thinking, but they are so coherent mm. in their community behavior, which made me to think that they are indeed very beautiful. But then it made, it made me think that how do they do this? They are one of the best engineers that I can think of. With precision, they organize their surface, such a small surface, with varieties of supramolecular structures like secretion system needle, this one which you can see here. This needle, which is very important for the bacteria to deliver the protein, you can easily, if I don't tell you that this is a bacterial needle, you may easily mistake this for one of these beautiful kind of those tambas in archaeological site. If you go to Hampi, you will see something like this. Now, these a beautiful needle which has a certain kind of symmetry it can be 19 fold or 22 fold and what you call it as an injection system needle precisely get tethered onto the bacteria they make it they make this kind of delivery system needle which if we even think of making it you know manufacture it we may take ages to do so and they do it within minutes they see the host they see the cell and they manufacture these kind of needles. They do their job and it is not that they are with this needle forever, they shed it off. So the beauty of, you know, making and breaking, it is there in both. It, it's so beautiful structures, but then they shed it off because they don't need it when the bacteria is inside. And when they are inside, they start secreting some other molecules to make it. So, um, yeah, outwardly you just think that they are either kokai, they are either, either round shape or rod shape. But the molecules that they are built with, and if you look into the cryo-electron microscopy of those structures, they are no less than a beautiful piece of art, I would say. If I were a painter, I could have drawn. Wow. It, is, it is this beautiful.